Mexico. We are one day out from surgery. I am non nervous. It should be a long day tomorrow. I'm excited and nervous, but I think I have everything I need. <laughs> and flustered and left my wallet so we had to turn around go back to the house so now we're running late uh yeah we're supposed to be there in like 10 minutes oops my bad so it is surgery day and i am on my way to the hospital we are almost there i'm super excited and i am very nervous uh, I didn't think I was going to be this nervous, but I am. <laughs> I'm trying to just focus more on um, the final results and, you know, why we're doing this and stuff like that rather than the scary stuff like going under and all that good stuff. So I'll see you guys, I guess, when I'm out of surgery. <laughs> Any unbearable hours later. Everything went amazing. Jasmine did absolutely phenomenal during the entire procedure. Mind you, I've been here in the waiting room for like eight hours. I didn't even get anything to eat yet because <laughs> I've been sitting here waiting like a little puppy dog waiting for the phone call uh, just to see the updates and stuff like that. Um, Shelly, his assistant, actually gave me a call. So they did a liposuction first. What the fat that they did find, they wound up taking it out and did more of a sculpting thing. And then they went into the breast augmentation and fixed everything um, the way Jasmine wanted. Um, they did hit the size that she wanted at 450, and then they wanted to the, the tummy tuck. So right now, um, just really waiting to go see her back in the recovery room. Um, so right now she's kind of passed out. Let me show you. She's, yeah, she's gave her uh, some pain medicine right before we got on the road. We got the green light. We are heading from the hospital to the hotel. Right now, Jasmine is super, super um, groggy still. Of course, that happens. Um, she did take up the full amount of time, which we were both really surprised. We didn't think she was gonna take up the full, uh, a lot of time of eight hours. Um, she was just shy of eight hours, but still it was pretty, pretty extensive. And of course, Dr. Shaddix uh, came personally down to the waiting room and we had a uh, talk and everything else and he kind of basically went through it and talked about every every step of the phase and we had and answered any questions that I had um, then immediately went right off to the recovery room and then I met Jasmine back there and she was super groggy super out of it but uh but it was good though the nursing staff definitely took care of her um, made sure she got some fluids in her obviously like feeding her ice and water and stuff like that. But all right now she's asleep, so we're just gonna go ahead and take it nice and easy. Got the air blowing a little bit, cool her off, and then uh, just gonna go ahead and take it all the way to the hotel.
next day. Hey guys, we are officially at the 24 hour mark. Um, it's about seven o'clock and yesterday I was in the OR at seven o'clock. So I um, just wanted to do a quick little update for you guys and tell you how I feel, how the night went and everything. Um, I'm mainly just really tired and I'm in pain in my abdominal area. Um, the muscles are really, really tight. That's what it feels like. Like I just had a really, really hard workout. And then I have this one spot, I think it's where the drain comes out and it hurts really, really bad when I'm like getting up and getting down, like so bad. I made my husband check to make sure that I wasn't like split open. I'm not, um, but everything's been going pretty good as far as um, pain, uh, what do you call it babe? Regulation, pain regulation, I'm gonna cut this out. Pain regulation? Yeah. Uh, pain. Pain tolerance? No. We are, we're keeping the pain at bay. What is that? Oh, regulating, regulating your pain levels. Yeah, you're right. Pain regulation. It hasn't been too bad because my husband's been on top of giving me my medicine at the right time. So, um, I've got pretty good pain. I can't remember. I'm just going to cut that out because I can't remember what I'm supposed to say. But right now, I'm just really hungry because I ate probably about half of a thing of Panera soup, and now I'm hungry. Uh, yesterday was pretty much like water, <laughs> pretty much. And so now I'm hungry, and Christopher's going to go down to Continental Breakfast and get us some food. I'll talk to you in a little bit. Thank you.